we're here at Passing Park Church in New Creek, Ohio. This is one of my friends, Ben. Um, what do you like about Passing Park and Rush? Uh, I'd say I really like all the youth stuff that we do here. Uh, Josh is a great youth pastor, makes everything fun, and uh, Rush is really fun. We have music, we have games, and all this crazy energy, and free food every once in a while. That's pretty good, and uh, I guess Passion Park Church is just a really like fun place to hang out. Everyone's friendly, so that's why I like it. All right, well, what I like about Passion Park Church is early in the morning, we go to Rush, and I go there to the Sunday school, and I listen to what Josh has to say, and he teaches us stuff and about Rush. I like to hang out with some friends, come here and play some basketball, listen to Josh, and listen to the band, play, and all that, so. All right, we are at Passing Park again, and this is dodgeball. When you play with stuff throwing it, you hit it. All right, let's watch. Attention, small group leaders, if I can have a moment of your time by the stage. Attention, small group leaders. Passing Park Church students playing basketball. Alright, this is the Rush Cafe. We get some cool beverages here. Alright, here's the contest. The first person to finish their soda pop. Beverage, soft drink, is the winner. But here's the catch. They may only drink their soda, pop, soft drink, when, go, their candle is lit. So basically, you are trying to blow out another person's candle, keep your candle lit, and drink your soda before another person finishes theirs. Do so I want to hold your gum? This table is clean. I just cleaned it myself. Just kidding. I didn't really. You can put it right on there. Alright, or I'll give you a piece afterwards. But, yeah, so you guys can see, okay? Alright. You can put your gum right beside her so you don't want to touch. Alright. Let's hear it. Yeah, go ahead and light them, guys. Please do not burn yourselves. Let's hear it for Ryan. Let's hear it for Mac. And let's hear it for Brooke the Cheater. All right, I think, yeah, your, your candle does have to be beside you. Oh, and, and the last rule is that your rear end has to remain on the seat, all right? That is a rule, okay? So, you can hold the lighter, you can do whatever you want, okay? When your candle gets blown out, you must stop drinking, okay? Brooks can Brooks a cheater. All right? All right, so here we go. On your marks, get set, go. This is the game that never ends. No! <laughs> Alright, we're gonna give him a, a 10 second no blowout rule. So go ahead and light him and you have 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 
four, three, two, one. Wow! And the winner, I know for me personally, it was a, a difficult week. It was a tough week. But the great thing is that God cares about what's going on in our life. And God sent his son to take care of our problems. And he did that on the cross. And we're going to be singing about the cross tonight. And so, for those of you that have a relationship with God, I want you to think about the cross and, and what it represents for you and, and the fact that God has come to take care of your problems. And for those of you who aren't really sure what the cross is, I want to tell you that, that Jesus came to die on the cross for you, for your problems, for your sins, and for your problems. So as we sing about the cross, you can reflect on that. God, if you're there, I wish you'd show me And God, if you care, then I need you to know me I hope you don't mind me asking the questions But I figure you're big enough I figure you're big enough 